Oh, and he caught with a message to, uh, it looks like our TNF champion. <laughs> yeah, Nick's wild. It says something a little mean there, huh? Something I don't think we can repeat on air, but if you can read, you know. Of course, Nick's wild unfortunately stabbed both the wildflowers in the back and then was attempting to permanently injure Keith Hodd. Keith Hodd working injured tonight. You can see their wrist is incredibly wrapped up after the carnage at the hands of Nick's Wild. That being said, just looking at them in the ring now, I think there's some built, there's some pent up anger that they need to get out. I don't know if Murphy knows the kind of danger he's in tonight. Of course, Buddies Inc. last week came out here and announced that they are putting together a book, a mystery story of Ooh. detective stories of missing wrestlers in 880 wrestling. And there's an entire chapter on Tatiana, who by the way, John, Tatiana, aside from me, John, who is on commentary tonight? Who am I speaking to? I would say that would be Tatiana. You know, I'd say that I'm flattered that they've written an entire chapter dedicated yeah. to me. Oh, another big chop from the Paracat, and they, they are lighting up the chest of Bill Murphy. Machine gunning it up, of course. I would say I'm flattered to have an entire chapter dedicated to me, but... Oh, not Wait. these two's book. The cover, just a two count, and of course, a few weeks ago, too, Joe Murphy elected some guy named John to get in there with Keith Hott, and of course, I said, yeah, let's do it. Let's make it a match. So tonight, I got Keith Hott and Joe Murphy as a return. Um, this is actually their rubber match. They're tied 1-1 in this series. Oh, oh and Murphy grabbing the, arm, the injured arm of Keith Hott and you bouncing it off the ropes, and now... Bouncing it off the railing as well. The tensions in our locker room recently have been pretty high with the Black Hand Society. Also, yeah, with the Black Sheep, Nick Wild, and what he's been doing to their former friends and our friends here. So they're all in the back, and uh, it gets pretty weird. But fortunately, Keith Ott is working through the pain of that injury. Uh, not helped at all by the actions of Joe Murphy. Some guy named John in the chat saying, when we release the inevitable podcast follow-up, which, oh God, oh God. Toddy's implicity in this heinous scheme will be revealed. They're trying to accuse you of something, Toddy. Yeah, I understand that. I had a podcast for a long time too, and it stunk just like yours will. Sheesh. Joe Murphy being ruthless and going after the injured arm of Keith Hart. Oh. Arm drag into a hold there. As much confidence as I have in Keith, you have to admit, we're going into a match injured and having that injured yeah. area worked on constantly, it gets to you. It makes it much more harder to do anything. I'll give something to Joe Murphy. He is, oh, outliner there. He is here week in and week out. I mean, is he getting any better? Is his personality getting any better? Is his attitude towards wrestling getting any better? No, but he certainly is here. Oh there. no, look at, oh! A stomp from Murphy to the injured hand of Keith Hunt. They're probably playing to Nick's wild. They try to get everybody in their throuple before. Oh, working on that injured wrist. That F you Nick's wild wrist. We are talking a lot in the previous match about confidence, Joe Murphy. Definitely showing confidence tonight against Keith Ott. He's out there alone, too. I haven't seen Joe uh, that confident by himself out there in quite some time. It'd be admirable if it was anybody else. That is a great point, Tatiana. Arm locking face, of face hold here. Putting pressure not only on the face and neck of Keith Ott, but also putting pressure on that arm and shoulder specifically. But oh, Keith powers out though and gets to the ropes. Chip, I think you gotta get in there. If, if Keith is on the ropes like that, you kinda gotta break that up. Oh. Bring around the Rosie. Oh, Murphy. <gasps> Murphy going for a sunset. That's not a safe place to be. Oh, Bearcat bumper. Golly. And Murphy. He got all that cake. Well, you can have your cake, you can eat it too, but that doesn't mean you'll feel good after no, the fact. No, no, Not what the doctor ordered for Joe Murphy. Yeah, let's see that again. 
Oh. Thank you, Sidekick Media Services, for that extra Bearcat bumper. Oh. Thought that was going to be it, but Joe Murphy is back. Oh. Winding up. Oh. Big elbow from the Bearcat. Followed by a big line from the Bearcat. Oh, Keith isn't done with Joe. Oh, they are not. They are firing up the crowd. They're getting that flyer back under them. Body slam! Big hey. knee drop here, full point press cover. Two, two count. I think Sadie, young Sadie, yelled that was three from the front row. It's I'll duck under the kick there. Using that arm again. Oh! Reach around for a DDT. I didn't see that coming. Neither did Two. I. Two. Yeesh. Two count. I can't believe I'm saying this. That was an impressive maneuver by Joe Murphy. I'm surprised. Yeah. But not quite enough to put down the, the Bearcat. Uh, Murphy has finally realized that the situation he is in. He's got to end this quick. Oh, no. Oh, no. We've never seen this done ever before ever. This is the first time this move has ever been performed. Oh! Not today, it's not up and over from Hunt. Oh. It's kiss to Murphy. Oh, and Murphy is in a dangerous spot now. Tatiana, we have seen this before. And Keith is looking to make a hot mess of Joe Murphy. You can ring it up, Keith Hutt victorious. The Bearcat Keith Hutt victorious shuts up Joe, at least for the night. We didn't have to deal with John, so maybe that's a win-win for us up here. It certainly feels like one, but it is a definite victory for the Bearcat tonight. Very impressive. Hello, friends. I'm your pal in the mainstream media. And, and I'm the Riz. And, and you know, much. Riz, it takes years of strenuous, dedicated training before you're worthy to step inside a professional wrestling ring. But it takes even more time to develop complex, highly astute opinions about professional wrestling. Am I right? That is correct. Yes. And you know where we can find that? Yes. On the wrestling man. That's right.